We are still following the great American eclipse or what's left of it at this point. We heard from Je George Mallet just a few minutes ago, but now my co-anchor, my partner, Joshua Short, he's also live down in Indy. Josh, what are things like on the ground for H you hello? at the Motor Speedway? Hi. Uh Oh, it, it is awesome here. This is my first time at the Motor Speedway. I was able to kiss the brick earlier, and then I was able to meet some race car drivers and meet some astronauts. Um, my friends met Lester Holt. Other than that, it's been great. <laughs> it's, it's been a great job. Look, I will be honest with you. I, I, we have sat at that desk, Lauren, for how many weeks? I mean, several weeks talking about we're about two months away. We're about a month and a half away. Now we're about less than a month away. We've been telling people about the great American eclipse and why it's so different, why it's so special. And we've been preparing others. We've been preparing you at home, right? But the difference this time around was I was here and, and I experienced it. And for the first time, I can tell you, I wasn't prepared myself. And it was evident, and I did not know this until after the fact where I got a few texts about it. It was a little bit of an emotional roller coaster for me, the, the few minutes that we were in totality. And that's what I want to show viewers of. I, I spoke with um, some friends at a, um, a national outlet, and this is what we, what we had on camera. Watch. A shocking part to me, honestly, when you're reporting on this for weeks and you're you're at the desk and talking about what to expect and what officials are saying and how cities are preparing, I think it's hard to stay in the moment and talk about why. We are in totality right now, forgive me. You can see the glow. If we can point our camera upwards, this is outstanding. It, you just asked me to describe the moment and I get a lump in my throat because what you're seeing right now is, is totality. And... It is really hard to describe this. No matter how much we've prepared you, our viewers, for this, being in this place, in this space right now, uh, it is, it is, it is heart rendering. It, it, it really is. Wow. Um, I don't, I don't really have that many hairs on my arm, but the ones that I do are upright right now, still, because it was a moment. It was, it was really a moment, and I thought it was just me. And then I look over and I see George is not saying much. And let me tell you, George can talk. Okay, he was not saying much. He was speechless, and a lot of people in this crowd just went silent until that moment right there. And it was exhilarating, Lauren. It, it really was to see it on camera, to see it in person. It's just different uh, than seeing it any other way. And I'm just. I'm just hopeful that our, our viewers at home was able to have a, a decent experience nonetheless as well. And it looks like you've had such a fun day. I saw you out. You were talking with a bunch of kids, your social media. You've been doing hits for different stations, right, Josh? Yes, it was a fun time um, all the way from Maine to the West Coast. We even spoke to some folks in Oregon who were like at 16% totality. I felt bad <laughs> just Oops. talking to them saying, oh, we're going to see the whole thing. <laughs> I was like, 16%, that's nothing. <laughs> so that was Let interesting. Let me show you this down uh, in but it was It was still fun. Yeah, right. It was it was an awesome time, and and obviously uh, being in Indiana and experiencing this, and and just traveling two and a half hours to our south was unique. The drive home is what I'm worried about, and that's why I'm going to hurry up and shut up um, and toss it back to you <laughs> in that studio. All right. Well, good work out there today. Thank you for joining us, and then we'll see you back here at the desk with me tomorrow. Be safe on your ride back. Uh, yes. That's if I don't take off. I'm tired, but we'll see what happens. <laughs> okay. Yes, Lauren, you're absolutely right. <laughs> Joshua Short, live for us in Indianapolis. We appreciate it, Josh. I'll see you tomorrow, that's for sure. Let's